All right, guys, it's Tuesday webinar day. You know what to do. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and go and subscribe to my webinar, six to seven. <sighs> oh my God, all right. Six to seven, Australian time, every Tuesday. Go, now, right? That's where you're gonna be able to access our Telegram channel. And I've mentioned on my Telegram, I'm gonna read it out, it's here. Oh, thanks for everyone that it's interacting on the Telegram. Such a very, very nice way to have you guys there. Um, soon as we hit 100 subscribers um, on this channel, I will set it up a private call exclusively for this channel, exclusively for Telegram channel, um, where, you know, I would, during the call, we work together on a strategy using data, a systematic approach, and a proving track record that actually works, the strategy that actually works. So, that is it, right? So as soon as we hit 100 subscribers to this Telegram channel, I will be doing all of the things I've just mentioned. So if you're not subscribed to my Telegram yet, you need to participate on the webinar. You need to be into the webinar so then I can you know, share the link with you all and then you can access the Telegram. So don't miss out the opportunity. We're gonna have one Telegram, we're gonna have one webinar today from six to seven. Uh, where I'm going to discuss about all the central bank policies that is happening around um, the globe today. And I will be, you know, giving my analysis um, for free for everyone. Okay, so let's talk about a few things that is happening on the globe right now and what will actually impact, impact the, week, um, the week ahead. We did have um, this morning, well, not this morning, it was like midnight for me, Australia time, we had the CPI from German. Um, it, it came much lower than expected. I have the numbers on my, uh, on my phone here. Um, I'm going to read it out. So pretty much everyone was expecting month over month, uh, the consensus was at 0.2% and it actually come at 0%. Right, so the previous was 0, uh, 0.3, the consensus was 0 0.2, and now the actual came as 0, 0, that's it, 0, 0, 0.0, right? So 0.2% lower than what everyone was expecting. Um, now, what that shows to me, that shows that maybe, well, of course, inflation is going down on German, but maybe we are having a slowdown on inflation on Europe in general, on Eurozone in general, okay? Uh, how can we tell that? Well, most of the times that we have a lower German read, reading on inflation, um, and then just after a few hours, we have the CPI for Europe in general, we have a lower CPI um, for Europe. So right now, we're going to have um, Europe CPI tonight at 9 o'clock. Uh, we're going to have the GDP as well, 9 o'clock. So we'll be very too big data that will decide how, you know, the things will roll into the next two months until end of the year. Um, the consensus for the GDP is at 0%. The quarter three GDP is at 0%. All right. Um, I do think it will come 0% or lower. Why is that? Well, because if you guys have been to my webinar last, um, last Tuesday, I've mentioned about the central banks and how, you know, this is what we will be discussing. How can I predict those moves? You know, how can I have such a good prediction on those data that comes in um, from the market? Well, I just look at central banks. That's, you know, it's a public information, free information out of there for everyone. Um, so, Looking at the central banks, you know, looking at ECB, Lagarde mentioned, she made it very clear that the growth of the country is slowing down. So the GDP may come lower, okay? Uh, now for inflation as well, she've mentioned that inflation will be coming down in the next couple months. So there you have it. So we have inflation data tonight. We have the core CPE and we have the CPE month of a month. Core CPE is expected 4.2% um, as the CPE month of a uh, year over year is expected 3.2%. Um, I do expect core CPE to come high, lower than expected um, and CPI to come as expected or a little bit higher. 
okay? Uh, because of the energy prices have been rising in, uh, in Europe since the war, um, then we may have to think about this, you know, higher prices, high inflation. Um, before that, we had a controlled sort of electricity prices, you know, um, so now we have a higher prices on, on gas and so on. So it may have a bit of influence in the CPI for tonight. All right. So if you want to know the rest of my analysis, if you want to know USD as well, you know, Europe in full, Australia, New Zealand, um, subscribe to my webinar. I will be talking about all of these and what I think that the rates, the central bank rates will be um, going forward. All right, guys. So please share this video with your friends as well. If you may have, you know, some, some family friends that like to trade, share this video with them. I guarantee you that this is good knowledge and they will appreciate uh, to be sharing, for you to be sharing this video with them. All right, I see you all from six to seven tonight on my webinar. Easy, free, out of charges. Just subscribe to it. See you guys.